Hello guys, I'm Aaron from Korean Lesson 101. If you travel abroad a lot, this kind of situation happens a lot. Here's the situation. Let's say we are in Italy that I've never been to. <laughs> Even if I've never been to Italy, I can imagine the gelato shops. There are so many varieties of gelatos you can choose from. It's not one or two. It could be hundreds. So it's very difficult to choose one. There are so many options. What should I eat? I wanna eat this, that, and that over there, but I cannot eat them all. In this kind of situation, normally we say, can I try this? And try some samples, and we can choose one that we like the most. In Korea, totally the same. When you come to Korea, visiting traditional markets or big malls is a fun part of your trip. There are various food or snacks that you can try, but you cannot eat them all even if they look all delicious. If you run into this kind of situation, you need to try some samples like gelato situation and choose one that you like the most. Then you need to know how to say, can I try this in Korean, right? In Korean, pretty much the same. 이거 먹어봐도 돼요? Can I try this? Point out the food that looks yummy and say, 이거 먹어봐도 돼요? 이거 먹어봐도 돼요? 이거 is this. 이거 먹어봐도 돼요? In this phrase, the pattern verb plus 아 or 어 봐도 돼요 is used. It corresponds to can I try in English. And in this case, 먹 from the verb 먹다 combines to the pattern like verb conjugation. 먹 plus 어 봐도 돼요? 이거 먹어봐도 돼요? If you have a difficulty conjugating the verb, check this video up here. Just point out the food that you want to eat and use this expression. 이거 먹어봐도 돼요? Then they will get you some samples very kindly. So please make sure to use this expression instead of picking some random food which is not your time. All right, this is it for today. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to our channel. And I'll see you in the next video.